Wait, what? There's a mouse, there's a mouse in the chicken coop and I got it. Oh my gosh. Wait, chicken, 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 chicken. Wait, chicken. there's a mouse, there was a mouse in the... I was coming to ask you if I could touch it. <laughs> we have to get Maui away from it though. Take him! Maui? Maui, no. you want a mouse? No, he can't eat it. You want a mouse, Maui? No! Oh, you, have to wash it. you have to wash this. I stepped on it. Okay. You stepped on the passing? Okay. No. no. See, it's so cute. Please. London, mice are not... No, it's free. <laughs> Please. So is disease. In the chicken food? In the food? That means there might be more in there. That means there might be mouse poop in the chicken food. Yeah. Right, look, I told you guys, she wants to keep every single thing that she finds. Hey, you I can't was keep doing a mouse. my chores. You can't keep a random mouse. I was doing my chores and I found no, it, so can't. I get to keep it. Can't keep a random mouse. I won't mouse. take my allowance this week, I'll take this. Baby, I know it's so cute, but wild mice carry diseases and they can transmit them to humans and animals. So, in order for you to keep that mouse, you have to take it to the vet. The vet has to examine it. Right, Mavi. Tell her she can't keep a wild mouse. Oh, my little animal lover. <laughs>
it's Sissy's turn. Fourth grade's coming out. So I came to the Yee Yee farm for the first time in like a month. Check in on everybody, see how it's going, see how hard they're working without me, and this is what I walk in on. Everybody crowded around the TV, watching Tyler play a 10 year old video game. How old is that game? Eight year old video game. He just keeps running the stick. Which I bought on eBay for 200 bucks, because there's not many of them. Go, go, go. He got from In case you're wondering guys, this is what's happening at EE Apparel. This is how your orders are getting out to you. This is, you're used to it, Maddie. Mm -hmm. How are the orders going? They're good. We caught up? Almost done. <laughs> almost, almost caught up, but certain things are more important, I guess. <laughs> Tyler went to rice, that's why he always takes rice and takes a whole season with him. I got him, this is a good D. Watch that middle linebacker, he's, he went. There you go! Oh, yeah! Yeah! <laughs> go for two, go for two. Shut the crowd down. Tied. All right, Tyler answered uh, first overtime with the touchdown. Pressure's on Oregon. <laughs> All the Oregon fans are like, come on, man, why you gotta pick Oregon? <laughs> hey, the computer bits it. Okay, it all comes down to this. Can't see the outside. Your corner just gets rushed. See if Oregon can do it. Oh! Rice, Thanks, guys. you guys will move up to at least 18 in the polls. Good job. Big win at was, Oregon. That was Garcia. He was a big recruit a few years ago. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I asked Parker if we're going to talk about our spring launch, and he said, no, still on winter launch. When are you getting married? I'm getting married in the summer. We don't know when. Is all of the Smiths invited? We're going to make it public? No. No. no, that's just for us. Hmm. Yeah. Sorry, I have a tour date on that day. I don't know to make it. Figures. You said summer, right? Yeah, the tour date on that day. Just kidding. Hey, thanks for holding up the, the Smiths so well while I'm on this movie shoot. I'm trying. I think people would rather have you, but uh, I'll do my best to, to hold up the farm in. Keep in people in the loop. Three years of doing the Smiths. This is the least I've filmed just because I've been busy, right. which is weird because I've been busy all my life. <laughs> but the kind of busy that I am on tour, I always have an extra hand uh, for the camera. But the kind of busy I am on the movie set, it's like there's nowhere to carry it. There's no, you know, it's always last minute. I'm bringing uh, Paul and Brian and maybe Ian out this week. So we'll get some stuff. But day off today and I head back there uh, tomorrow or tonight. So, yeah, head there tonight. Going back to the movie set tonight. So you're gonna have to film some more part. Yeah, I haven't even seen you in weeks. I know, I haven't seen you in four weeks. Congratulations on your engagement. Thank you. <laughs> All right, it is, it's 11.15 and um, PM and the wrap for the day. I think I talked on this camera when I got here this morning. Another full day of shooting and another day that I didn't shoot <laughs> anything with this camera. So at this point I was thinking uh, my truck's running outside and it's freezing. I've been, this last shot was freezing. As my truck's warm, warming up, I can't even talk. I was thinking I would use this vlog for my future self to look back on, on this video. Um, shooting this movie. We are uh, a little over halfway done. Maybe I'll never do another movie in my life, maybe. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to be as present as I can in this one. And that's all we could ever do in life is, um, instead of thinking, I wonder what the next movie is gonna be, or wonder, I wonder if I'll do this again. It's, it's more like, you know, I'm gonna work as hard as I can to make this character come to life today. I can't wait for y'all to see this movie. I, I hope, I hope it's good. I think it will be. I, I trust everyone around me and all the producers and the 
director and the studio, I, I, pr I trust everyone. It's, it's myself, <laughs> maybe, that I don't trust as much because I just really want, I, I think this is a great script and I want this character to come to life and I want his story to matter to people. I want people to watch it and walk away and go, that was, that was a story of redemption. That's probably the most I've revealed about this plot so far, but it's just, I want my future self to know that when you look back on this movie, that every, every scene mattered, every light mattered, every camera angle and an audio clip and mic placement and every PA and every AD and, and everybody behind the camera work that mattered every time. Or, or if it didn't work, we did it again. That's a little different than the music video world. You know, music video world, we set up and we shoot in one day and we work really hard and we work 14, 15 hours in a day in inclement weather with a great crew, but we're shooting fast and we don't have time to fix a light. Like if a light is, is not, if something's not lit perfectly in a music video, we, f we flip the camera around and use the sun and we go with it because because we don't have time. We only have one day and we shoot things in a music video. We shoot random things like we might see, oh wow, look at that sunset hitting the mountain right now. Let's shoot that. Let's sing right here next to this fence post right now and we'll shoot it and then, and then we'll use that or we might not, but we just shoot like crazy. But this is different. Everything is planned in this movie. Every shot is planned and uh, we build it and they, they, they're looking for the perfect shot. So when you guys see this movie, you know, maybe it's two hours long, you know, it'll go by and these scenes will go by. Some of them will go by in seconds that took hours to set up and hours to film for seconds of a, of a tiny scene. And they all matter that, that they all collectively come together to make a movie. And it's, it's a crazy beautiful thing to do that. And my creative brain, you know, as a singer, songwriter, musician, performer has never been put to that kind of test like this. It's a, it's a, it's a different part of my creativity and it's a challenge and I'm nervous every day. I'm, I've got butterflies in my stomach every day to remember my lines and hit my mark and react to the other actors and say it in a believable way and have my face look believable every time. Similar to music video, but different, you know, to my future self. Um, it was worth it. It was worth it. I'm so cold right now. It's so cold and I'm tired. I haven't slept very well. I haven't eaten very much. I mean, I eat one time a day. I skip every dinner, but it's worth it. One day this vlog will live at the same time the movie's out and I hope you guys love it. Sorry, I'm not taking it everywhere. I just don't, I don't have enough hands. I don't have the brain power to uh, sit there and vlog when I'm literally trying to be in the scene, so.